Now this is where the power of the cloud comes in. The cloud enables powerful, scalable computational power and algorithmic processes they call machine learning. The firewall is the enforcer while the cloud does the detection. And this is immensely powerful when combined with other automation techniques in the firewall like uh, dynamic address groups and sinkholing. As you can see here, the Palo Alto Network's DNS solution has got a lot of juice. The firewalls are enforcer while the cloud and the DNS security service and these many other intelligent sources, they all provide the detection capability for the firewall. So now here's a quick play by play. Notice that we're doing an ordinary DNS lookup from an infected client and the firewall's checking its local signatures, but here's what's different. There's an additional query to the DNS security cloud, and as I mentioned earlier, this cloud data is not only leveraging machine learning, but it's enriched by other sources as well, and this added query provides the information for a just-in-time detection, allowing that firewall to do some quick reactions and safeguard the network. It's, it's like Aikido or some sort of Kung Fu crane kick. And to help provide an additional context for this, consider some of the more recent type of attacks like oil rig. Oil rig leveraged DNS to steal local system information, things like users and groups and administrator accounts and such. It also used PowerShell scripts to install Mimikatz and it stole account information with Mimikatz. All of that was leveraging DNS. Now, when you consider what Palo Alto Networks provides in terms of protection, you have signatures and app IDs, but you also have the new DNS security service, which enriches the firewall's ability to respond. This, of course, is in addition to the many other threat prevention features in the firewall and features that are part of the security operating platform.